The scientific community experienced a significant setback when a groundbreaking quantum computer had to be shut down immediately due to emergency concerns. In an unexpected interview, Michio Kaku disclosed troubling details about quantum computing, aliens, and artificial intelligence, which deeply affected the scientific community. Why was this revolutionary quantum computer shut down, and what important details has Michio Kaku shared? Watch this video as Michio Kaku discusses the shutdown of the quantum computer. We all know that digital computers changed virtually every aspect of our life. Well, the arrival of quantum computers could be even more historic than that. Well, a quantum computer goes beyond silicon. Yeah. Quantum computers, however, are not ready for prime time yet. Several innovations of the 21st century have revolutionized our world, transforming industries and enabling tasks that seemed impossible just a few decades ago. From artificial intelligence to quantum computing, these changes have been significant. Quantum computing in particular has gained a strong reputation for its revolutionary properties and sophistication. What began as a speculative idea has developed into groundbreaking technology with immense potential. The advent of quantum theory in the early 20th century marked the start of the quantum computing era. Quantum theory, which explains the behavior of atomic and subatomic particles, serves as the foundation for quantum mechanics and ultimately quantum computing. However, the concept of quantum computing gained momentum in 1980 when scientist Paul Benioff proposed using quantum systems for computation. He proposed that a new generation of advanced computers could be built using quantum mechanics to utilize phenomena like superposition and entanglement. This idea was further developed by physicist Richard Feynman in 1982. Feynman envisioned a new type of computer based on quantum mechanics, capable of solving problems that conventional computers cannot handle. Initially, this was just a theory. Quantum computing began to take shape in the 1990s as researchers made significant strides towards realizing Feynman's vision. Mathematician Peter Shore made a notable contribution in 1994 by developing a quantum algorithm that had a significant impact on the scientific community. This algorithm revealed the potential of quantum computers to break encryption systems and achieve other challenging tasks. This sparked renewed interest in developing quantum computers. Just a decade later, the first practical quantum computers emerged. Initially, these computers were limited, struggling to process input data effectively. One example was Isaac Chong's two-qubit quantum computer, created in 1998. Chong, a researcher from Los Alamos National Laboratory, collaborated with Neil Gershenfeld from MIT and Mark Kubinek from the University of California. Their work demonstrated the principles of quantum computation. However, this invention was relatively insignificant in the broader context because it couldn't address the significant problems facing the scientific community at the time. The most disappointing aspect of this quantum computer was that it only had two qubits. A qubit, or quantum bit, is a fundamental unit that quantum computers use to store and process information. The more qubits a quantum computer has, the more powerful it becomes. Isaac Chong's two-qubit quantum computer would be entirely outmatched by a 10,000-qubit quantum computer. However, the strength of quantum computing lies not only in quantum mechanics or in the number of qubits used. Qubits have unique properties, unlike bits, or ones and zeros, used in non-quantum computers. One of these properties is superposition. In a normal computer, a bit must be either zero or one. A qubit, however, can represent both zero and one simultaneously. Now, this allows qubits to adapt to situations by superimposing themselves as needed. This single property has led many scientists and quantum physicists to recognize the potential of quantum computing. They realize that quantum computers can solve problems much faster than classical computers and on a much larger scale. Another notable feature of quantum computers is the quantum gates. These gates manipulate the quantum states of qubits to perform specific computations or run algorithms to achieve a targeted goal. This sophisticated mode of operation is highly advanced. In 2001, a group of scientists from IBM used nuclear magnetic resonance to control qubits, marking the first successful execution of Shor's algorithm. This breakthrough inspired further advances in quantum computing, leading to the development of more sophisticated quantum computers. The number of qubits in quantum computers continued to increase, enabling more complex calculations. In 2010, 
researchers at the University of Science and Technology of China achieved a significant milestone with quantum teleportation. This phenomenon involves transferring a particle's quantum state from one location to another without physically moving the particle. The researchers successfully teleported quantum state particles over distances of up to 10 meters. This achievement demonstrated that quantum information could be transmitted over long distances, which is crucial for developing quantum networks. In 2013, Google and NASA launched a major project by creating the D-Wave computer at NASA's Ames Research Center. This advanced computer had a broad range of potential applications, from exploring new alien worlds to improving Google search engines. Hartman Neven, who was Google's director of engineering at the time of D-Wave's launch, said, We believe quantum computing could address some of the toughest challenges in computer science, especially in machine learning. Machine learning focuses on creating better models of the world for more accurate predictions. For example, to cure diseases, we need improved models of their development. To develop effective environmental policies, we need better models of climate change. And to enhance search engines, we need to understand spoken queries and the web content better to provide the best answers. D-Wave made significant strides by solving optimization problems 10,000 times faster than classical computers and addressing various machine learning issues. There was a strong belief that this groundbreaking technology had vast potential, with some NASA experts even speculating it might help confirm the existence of extraterrestrial life. Shortly after quantum computing emerged, a theory began to take hold among astronomers and cosmologists. This theory suggests that quantum computers and black holes might be more closely connected than previously thought. According to quantum mechanics, black holes are highly efficient at storing quantum information. Some theories propose that extraterrestrials could be using black holes as quantum computers, which might explain both the mysterious nature of black holes and the elusive nature of extraterrestrial life. Some astronomers believe that creating computers based on black hole principles could make it much easier to find extraterrestrials. The D-Wave project was a promising step towards achieving advanced computing capabilities. However, the government shut down the project shortly after it began. This decision stemmed from concerns within the scientific community about the potential misuse of quantum computers. These machines are so advanced that they could potentially break encryption systems and decode cryptographic algorithms, which are essential for securing data and ensuring private communication. Before quantum computers, cracking these encryptions was virtually impossible. For example, a quantum computer could potentially decode the combination to a million dollars safe if you didn't have the code. Given these risks, it's understandable why there was significant concern about the technology being misused or falling into the wrong hands. While NASA paused its search for alien worlds using the D-Wave 2, Google advanced its efforts and achieved quantum supremacy in 2019. This significant breakthrough was made possible by Google's powerful quantum processor, Sycamore. Quantum supremacy demonstrates how a quantum computer can solve a problem that would be impossible for any classical computer to solve in a reasonable time frame. Google's quantum processor solved a problem that would take a classical computer a million years in just a few seconds. This achievement astonished scientists and the public, showcasing the potential of quantum computing. By 2020, IBM responded with the IBM Q system, the first fully integrated quantum computer designed for commercial use. This was a significant development because previous quantum computer models were only available for research or non-commercial use. For the first time, the public had the opportunity to access a customized quantum computer and use it as needed. This breakthrough marked the beginning of a new era for quantum computing. With these advancements, organizations like NASA could renew their efforts to search for extraterrestrial life. The likelihood of extraterrestrial life is high, and quantum computers might help solve the Fermi paradox, which addresses the contradiction between the high probability of alien life and the lack of evidence for it. If advanced civilizations were present in our galaxy, we would expect to see substantial evidence of their existence throughout the galaxy and on Earth. What if we hadn't detected advanced civilizations because we haven't used the right technology? It's certainly possible that extraterrestrials use technology so advanced that only next-generation tools, like mega-quantum computers, can reveal their presence. This is a topic of debate among astronomers and cosmologists. Experts like Michio Kaku have proposed advanced methods for searching, such as energy neutrinos and quantum communications. Kaku, in an interview, introduced an intriguing idea the existence of a hidden alien superhighway that billions of aliens might be using to navigate our cosmos without being detected.
This theory could offer a solution to the mystery of extraterrestrials, but until our technology advances enough to test it, the answer remains uncertain. Scientists have long focused on searching for extraterrestrial life by looking for radio signals from distant star systems. However, this approach might limit our chances of finding evidence of alien life. In the future, when quantum computers reach their full potential, we might be able to explore new avenues for discovering such life. Quantum computing is currently known for its abilities in large-scale optimization, complex simulations, and advanced machine learning. Yet, until physicists can fully control and manipulate qubits, the full capabilities of quantum computing remain out of reach. One notable phenomenon observed so far is quantum entanglement, where qubits seem to be linked in such a way that their states are correlated regardless of the distance between them. In other words, the quantum state of each particle cannot be analyzed independently, and they influence each other even when they're light years apart. Albert Einstein once called this spooky action at a distance. This phenomenon allows qubits to work together on many tasks and processes at once, which is one reason why quantum computers are so fast at solving problems and breaking encryption. Some experts predict that within five years, quantum computing will significantly change encryption as we know it. You might be concerned about quantum computers being used for hacking and cybercrime, but there's no need to worry. Experts are addressing this issue by creating quantum-resistant cryptographic algorithms. These algorithms act as advanced security measures designed to protect against attacks from quantum computers. They use sophisticated cryptography to ensure the safety of our data and digital systems. Beyond security, quantum computers offer benefits in fields like medicine and machine learning by simulating atoms and molecules. In finance, they can process large amounts of data, assess risks and vulnerabilities, optimize portfolios, and simulate financial systems to predict outcomes. Quantum experts are working hard to bring their ideas to reality, but they face some significant challenges. Issues like compatibility, high costs, and a shortage of skilled professionals are major obstacles to achieving advanced quantum computing. Developing these complex systems requires extensive time, planning, and calculations. Until quantum computing reaches its full potential, solving some of today's complex scientific problems may remain out of reach. Physicist Michio Kaku has suggested that quantum computing could lead to groundbreaking advancements if used in innovative ways. AI-powered quantum computing might become a powerful force driving technological progress, with the potential to transform the world in ways that we can barely imagine. However, AI itself is also a force with enormous and potentially dangerous implications. Experts speculate that the merger of quantum computing and AI could lead to revolutionary changes. Michio Kaku has suggested that quantum computers could transform the AI landscape. While AI excels at generating data, it struggles with preventing misinformation. The application of quantum computing could address this by using features like quantum entanglement and inference to enhance computational efficiency and ensure information accuracy. Quantum-powered AI chatbots could operate at unprecedented speeds, handle complex tasks with high precision, and even predict future events. While the scientific community is excited about this potential, combining these two technologies also presents some serious challenges. There are risks linked to this groundbreaking technology. For years, there have been concerns about artificial superintelligence and the possibility of an AI takeover. The fear is that AI could become so advanced that it surpasses human control and ends up dominating the world. Elon Musk, the well-known inventor and tech enthusiast, stated in an interview, I think the danger of AI is much greater than the danger of nuclear warheads by a lot. Mark my words, AI is far more dangerous than nukes. While this might sound extreme, it's worth noting the significant progress in artificial intelligence. Recently, artificial general intelligence, or AGIs, have started to emerge, and artificial superintelligence systems, ASIs, are expected to follow soon. These developments are seen as potential steps towards a major AI revolution. Imagine the impact if highly intelligent AI systems had access to quantum computing. Some conspiracy theorists worry that the chaos from integrating AI with quantum computing could be unprecedentedly alarming. Michio Kaku, among other experts, is concerned about this potential fusion. He believes that combining advanced AI software with cutting-edge quantum computing hardware could create an incredibly powerful machine with possibilities beyond our current understanding. However, these are speculative ideas, and there is no concrete evidence that this will actually happen. 
Nevertheless, a merger between quantum computing and AI could also bring some substantial benefits. For instance, in cosmology, AI-powered quantum systems could simulate the universe's early stages, explore the quantum realm, and uncover fundamental aspects of nature that have previously been elusive. Such systems could enable scientists to analyze the cosmos on an unprecedented scale and achieve remarkable discoveries. We might eventually uncover the true nature of black holes and their potential use as quantum computers by aliens. The possibilities of quantum computing are vast, especially when combined with AI. However, we're still far from achieving the full potential of quantum computing. Measures need to be in place to prevent misuse and ensure data protection. If these requirements are met, humanity could enter a new era of advanced computing, potentially eliminating the need to shut down quantum computers as has happened in the past. As we delve deeper, it's essential to consider how these technologies could shape various industries and aspects of our daily lives. One potential application of quantum computing is in the field of healthcare. The ability of quantum computers to process vast amounts of data and perform complex simulations can significantly accelerate drug discovery and development. By modeling molecular interactions at an unprecedented scale, researchers can identify potential drug candidates more quickly and accurately. This could lead to the development of new treatments for diseases that have long eluded effective therapies, bringing hope to millions of patients worldwide. Moreover, quantum computing can revolutionize personalized medicine. With its capability to analyze genetic information and medical histories in a fraction of the time it takes current systems, quantum computing can enable the creation of highly personalized treatment plans tailored to individual patients' genetic makeup. This would enhance the effectiveness of treatments and minimize side effects, marking a significant leap forward in healthcare. In the field of climate science, quantum computing holds promise for addressing some of the most pressing environmental challenges. Accurate climate modeling requires the processing of vast data sets and the simulation of complex interactions with the Earth's climate system. Quantum computers can handle these tasks more efficiently than classical computers, providing more accurate predictions of climate change impacts and helping scientists develop more efficient mitigation strategies. This could play a crucial role in our efforts to combat global warming and protect our planet for future generations. Now, another exciting application is in the realm of cybersecurity. While quantum computing poses a threat to current encryption methods, it also offers the tools to develop next-generation cryptographic systems that are virtually unbreakable. Quantum-resistant cryptography will be essential in safeguarding sensitive information in an increasingly digital world. As we continue to rely on digital platforms for everything from banking to communication, ensuring the security and privacy of our data becomes paramount. The transportation industry, too, stands to benefit from quantum computing. Optimizing traffic flow, reducing congestion, and improving the efficiency of logistics networks are just a few areas where quantum computing can make a significant impact. By processing real-time data from various sources, Quantum computers can develop optimal traffic management solutions, reducing travel times and fuel consumption. This not only enhances convenience for commuters, but also contributes to environmental sustainability by lowering emissions. Quantum computing can also transform the financial sector. By enabling more accurate risk assessments and optimizing investment strategies, quantum computers can help financial institutions make better informed decisions. This can lead to more stable financial markets and improved economic growth. Additionally, quantum computing can enhance fraud detection systems, providing an additional layer of security against financial crimes. As we integrate quantum computing and AI into various sectors, it's crucial to address the ethical and societal implications of these technologies. Ensuring that advancements are used responsibly and for the greater good is a collective responsibility. Policymakers, researchers, and industry leaders must collaborate to establish guidelines and regulations that promote transparency fairness, and accountability. Moreover, investing in education and training is essential to prepare the workforce for the quantum era. As these technologies become more prevalent, there will be a growing demand for skilled professionals who can develop, implement, and manage quantum systems. Providing opportunities for learning and professional development will help bridge the skills gap and ensure that we can fully harness the potential of quantum computing. As we look ahead to the evolving landscape of quantum computing and artificial intelligence, it's crucial to consider how these advancements could influence global challenges as well as everyday life. Beyond the immediate applications, these technologies have the potential to reshape our world in profound ways. Thank you for watching this video. 
Please share your thoughts in the comments below and stay tuned for more videos like this.